Hi, welcome back to the Habits Kitchen. I'm Dr. Chan, the Habits Doctor. Today I'm going to uh, do a food tasting of the different kinds of rice. White rice, brown rice, red rice, black rice. When it comes to rice, I've been eating white rice and white rice only. I very much preferred white rice almost for 47, 47, 48 years of my life. It's only the last couple of years when I began to explore, initially for health reasons, and now I think I have changed my mind totally about what I prefer in terms of rice. Okay, so today I'm not talking about the health benefits of these different kinds of rice, the different nutrient composition. I'm just going to talk about which one tastes nicer, which one I would prefer when it comes to these four different rice. Let me start with uh, this white rice. I used to like only white rice and I used to even think that uh, people who choose brown rice are people who are health freaks, you know, people who give up the enjoyment of food for the sake of health. I used to choose and there's no white rice, I, I would rather not have rice. And that was how I was for 47, 48 years of my life. Right? So let me go and try this white rice again. Yeah. Let's remember it to be you know, texture, very nice and fluffy. You know, just like I had always used to like it. But not much taste to it. Of course, there's a bit tinge of fragrance in some of the fragrant rice. This is quite good. Right, but not very spectacular. Right? If if it's uh, nice, it was would be because it is very familiar. Right, it's something that I've been eating for 40 over years of my life. So not bad. Let's try this brown rice. The texture of this brown rice is um, not any different from the white rice, at least to me. I mean, for people who often complain or think that brown rice is so hard and so not palatable, I think it's a matter of how you adjust the water to rice ratio when cooking it. So. In fact, I have done a video, you can go to the link here, right, on uh, how you can uh, make brown rice to the texture that you like, you prefer every single time. I mean, it's a matter of getting the water to rice ratio to cook the brown rice to the texture that you like. Everybody is different, right? They just need to adjust, 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 fine tune, calibrate until you like it. So, to me, this brown rice, the texture, not any difference from white rice in terms of the flavor it has a um, more flavor than the white white rice is like there's nothing there so very very subtle right but brown rice it has a very earthy you know uh, almost a little nutty but not so much but a very more earthy kind of flavor to it right which is quite nice yeah so let's go on to the red rice I see this is the red rice Let's try the red rice. It's a little bit firmer, harder than the brown rice. At least this brand cooked in this way with this amount of water. So if you want it softer, I can always adjust the water the next time and cook it. But it has a, a nicer bite to it. It has a, the mouth feel to it. The flavor is much stronger. It has a, a almost a sweet, much stronger nutty flavor to it. I think it's quite nice, you know. It has a lot more character. It has a lot more personality than the brown rice. Definitely more than the white rice. So now let's try the black rice. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. Yeah. There's so much dimension to this black rice. 
they almost have a, a berry smoky kind of flavor to it and the texture for at least for this brand right the texture is softer than the red rice right uh, similar to the brown rice definitely firmer than the white rice but it's, it's a flavor it's a flavor that 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 sets it apart right that um it has a so many dimensions to this it has a it's a berry has a not so much nutty but berry smoky a tinge of sweetness very nice now i can imagine i can make quite a number of rice dishes from this that they can probably turn out quite well all for 40 over years of my life you know white rice is the only rice a go-to rice and i think it's because i was used to it from very young right and also because of the singaporean cuisine the malay cuisines the the Chinese cuisine, the Indian cuisine, or even the international, the Thai, the Vietnamese, the Korean cuisines, where there is a lot of strong flavored, strong flavored gravies, sauces, soups, right? For which um, they often call for a blank sheet of paper, a blank canvas, like a white rice, for it to absorb all the flavors, right? And then you enjoy the dish, you know, with the white rice. You know, as the almost like the sponge to absorb all the flavors of the sauces of the gravies of the soups of the different dishes that the white rice is accompanying and but i think if we, if that's what we want i think brown rice can play that role quite well as well because the, the flavor the distinctive flavor that it has is a lot more subtle of all this unpolished rice all these three whole grain rice it's a lot more subtle right so certainly i think you know it lends itself you know um to be able to play that role when we are eating it together with dishes with a lot of sauces gravies soups right but it has a, a nice you no know, little texture to it right and uh the fact that it's more healthy right, more healthful right it's, it's a bonus it's a bonus really is just a bonus right this red rice and this black rice because of its much stronger personality on its own you know um the, its distinctive flavors the red rice don't you know, have this sweetness to it you know the the black rice has this smokiness this berry flavor to it i think these two rice are prime candidates for making outstanding standalone rice dishes i already have a few ideas of what i can do with these two very interesting rice if nothing else you know um i must say look at me as an example i've been a fan of white rice for a good 40 over years 47 48 years of my life no white rice i wouldn't have any rice i i, I really didn't like all the whole grain rice right but now white rice is not my first choice in fact if there's no brown red or black rice or other whole grain rice i'd rather not have rice right, uh, right now if i'm gonna have rice right and i'm gonna have it with with a lot of different dishes that has sauces and flavors that are very strong and i want something that absorb all of them i would choose brown rice i would choose brown rice because brown rice and not only uh is it able to do that it has this texture that i now prefer to white rice it has the flavors Right, that I think you know um, adds to without interfering with the flavors of the sauces, the gravies, and the soups uh, of the dishes that we eat it with. And so that's uh, brown rice. And um, of course, there's added bonus that uh, it's a whole grain, unpolished rice, and and the health benefits of that. In fact, if I'm going to choose a rice to make fried rice, I would definitely choose brown rice, not white rice. Right, got brown rice ah, have you really tried brown rice that is you know a good brown rice fried rice you by far be hands down i need white rice fried rice maybe you should have a cook off on brown rice fried rice versus white rice fried rice and if you're going to do fried rice i'm i really going to only going to use brown rice See? It has this texture, it has these flavors, you know, that wow, 
you know, hands down. Right. But if I'm going to create interesting standalone dishes, this will be my choices. Okay. Uh, if you are one of those people who have been struggling with switching over whole grain rice because you are too used to white rice, I hope this is an encouragement to you. I've been a fan of a diehard fan of white rice for 47, 48 years of my life. But right now, I'm choosing whole grain rice, whether it's brown, red or black, over the white. Not because of health consideration, health benefits, but simply because right now I prefer this whole grain rice over this white. And it was because I decided to explore, experiment. Right now, I enjoy them. Then you have nothing to lose. Go ahead and try them. You know, um, right? Maybe you'll be like me. Right? You'll find yourself liking, preferring this health, more healthy whole grain rice than the polished white rice that you have gotten used to. So, go and try. Have fun. This is all I have for this video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe right, to this channel. Right. Um, and I hope to be able to reach more people right, and uh, encourage more people to change their eating habits for health. And it is about not just choosing healthy, it's also about eating happy at the same time as they choose healthy. All the best. Have fun.